In this tutorial, I'm going to try and get you quickly up and running with timing tracks for lyrics in X Lights. So, first thing I'm going to do is create a new sequence and a musical sequence. And what I've done to avoid any copyright issues, I've just recorded me speaking. So, there won't be actually any music, but you can still get the idea. So I've got uh, a lyric track here. And what I do, I tend to set up a separate view when I'm dealing with lyric tracks called Singing Elements. And it just gives you a nice clean interface. So let me just temporarily drop a singing face onto the singing tree here. And now I'm going to import the lyrics. Normally what you would do, you would go to Google or something like that and find the lyrics for your song. But I'm going to use some for the words I've spoken. So I just go import lyrics. So it was a case of right clicking on that timing track and import lyrics. And I'm going to paste my lyrics in here. Now, if you've got any text that has foreign characters, you know, that have things like accents or umlauts, like in German or Portuguese, change those. So if it's E with an umlaut, just change it to a normal letter. And then click OK. And you see it's now imported the lyrics. Now, if your lyrics start way into the song, when you go into this import lyrics component, enter that time there, then it will make sure the lyrics at least start in the right position. But all we're going to do now is we're going to position the sentences. So if you look at the waveform, you can usually see where words are being spoken. It gets a little bit more difficult with, the, with music embedded as well, but you can usually pick out lyrics being sung. But I can see here that this is clearly the first sentence here. So I'm going to position this like this. So I can just highlight this area and I click my spacebar. So you want to learn X lights. Okay, and there you go. And then I can do it like this. Well, you've come to the right place. That's okay. So that's well, you've come to the right place. Now there's two options when you're moving these. If I, if it's the arrows, it will move the lyrics like this. If I select the little hand, it pulls it away, which in this case is what we want because there's a space between the two sentences. Well, you've come to the right place. Now, you can see I've made a little bit of a mistake here, or the song is different. So, you see, it says, well, you have come to the right place. But I actually said, you've come to the right place. Okay, so I change that. And then it says, X Lights Training Nuggets. Quick, straight to the point tutorials. So I can pull this out and resize. So that's it. Now, we, we would do this for the entire song. And what I will do now, save regularly. So I would save the file now so that you don't lose anything. I'm not going to do it in this case. I'm just going to rename my track now to lyrics. So now it comes, I'm going to break these words down, the lyrics down into individual words. I do this by right clicking here and saying break down phrases. And you can see now if we zoom in, we have the individual words. And all we do now is go along finding each of these words. So, hey, hey, so there we go. We can position that one. Now there's a big gap where I don't speak for a few milliseconds. And it will say, so you've come. Oh, so you want to learn. Yep, so I now need to probably zoom in a little bit. And I look for the word so. So you, so this is obviously so, so, you, so you, and then we've got the U coming straight after it. Now you don't have to be 100% accurate at this point, but it makes your life easier if you're, you know, at least in the ballpark. You want, you want, you want, you want, so you can see the U there, and then want, and then to, 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 hear the T, to learn. To learn. So we can go to learn. And then here is the word 
X lights. And I'll come back to this in a moment. You'll see something strange that happens, but I will show you how you fix it afterwards. So move on. Now I'm going to go through and do these, but I'm going to drop this in post-production so you don't have to sit and watch me do the same thing on every sentences, uh, sentence. So here we go. Okay, so there you go. We've finished all of the words. And now I'm going to move on to now creating the mouth shapes, the phonemes that are going to tell my singing face what position it should be in. So all I need to do now is right click here again and we go break down words. And you can see now it's generated the phonemes for all of the words. However, we do have a problem and it's worth checking this out when you first convert a lyrics track. You look here, it's not giving me any phonemes. And the reason is X lights is not a word. So what you're going to do, we're going to double click on this and it will allow me to edit. Now I will tell you something. This is actually a setting in X lights. If I go to my preferences, let me find it. This option here, by default, it's set to play timing. I prefer it to edit text, so I double click. Okay, so if, if you've got the other option, you need to shift click to edit, but I suggest you change that. This is much more useful. Okay, so I can, what I'm going to do, I'm going to make this small and I'm going to create another word. So I'm going to call this the word Lights, because we know lights is a word. Oh, X lights, X lights, X light. And I'm going to make this word X, because that's also a word. Okay, and you see also it's got this you've incorrectly. Yeah, so we may have to put this in so that it detects it correctly. And if we want to test any time, we can just go break down word and you can see it's fixed that. And I could do the same here. Break down word, break down word. And then we also got X lights again. I'm going to do the same again. Control C, Control V, so that I've got two words. And then I'm going to make this the word X. And this the word lights and you'll come across this type of problem quite a lot so it's it's useful to know how to fix this and we can now break down word break down word and if we look now we have phonemes for everything however this is not the end of the story we now need to start positioning these phonemes to actually the, the proper words. So when you've got multisyllable words, you know, like um, wizard, yeah, you've got to find out where that Z sound is so that you can get the mouth moving correctly. So if we zoom in again, we can start here, hey, I've got nothing to worry about there. This is absolutely fine, hey. I might just want to tweak it in a little bit. Okay, hey. So you can see this is probably where it starts. So you want to, yeah, so we can actually just pull that in just a little bit, just to fine tune it. Now, what you tend to find is when you're speaking, you, these, you know, the starts of words like want, it tends to divide it relatively evenly. So we need to actually reduce the size of the W sound because that's quite, you know, only a small portion of the word. And the same here with you. I'm just, the start of the word, I'm just decreasing a little bit. And we've got want to learn. Same with the L, the L needs to go smaller. X, that's absolutely fine. And particularly here, lights. No one says lights. So we pull this back and we've got, and we can also correct this a little bit, bring it in. And I'm going to go through this all the same. I may fast forward again.
Now, this is one that's important. We, this is two syllables, training. So we need to find the word train. Train, 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 train. So it's there, train. So this is the start of the ning part, this ETC, training. So the mouth is going to close a little bit. So I need to pull this along to here to get that transition. And then finally, here we've got another one, nuggets. So nuggets, 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 so, nuggets, nuggets, nuggets. nuggets. So we can just hear it slightly there, nuggets. And then let me just polish off the last sentence. Okay, that should be good enough. So let's zoom out a little bit. And let's see how we've got on. So now we go to our singing face and we must now allocate that to the lyrics timing track. Well, there we go. And let's give it a shot. Hey, so you want to learn X lights? Well, you've come to the right place. X lights training nuggets, quick, straight to the point tutorials. And obviously you can go back and you can fine tune things if it's not moving quite right, go back, move things around. Um, but you can see it's uh, not rocket science, it just takes a little bit of time, just a bit of OCD to get those mouth movements accurate. So until next time, see you later.